stripes and bright stars through the perilous fight or the reports we watched were 
so gallantly streaming and the rocket's red glare the bombs bursting in air gave proof through the night that our flag was still there oh say star-spangled banner yet wave or the land of the free and the home of the brave good evening and welcome to Bret Hart High School Senior Class of 2020 Virtual Graduation. I am Isabella Larg Messino and I am the Senior Class President. Before we begin, I would like to thank all those who had a part in organizing our virtual and drive through graduation. Though the situation is not ideal, we very much appreciate all the thought and effort put into making our senior graduation memorable. Lastly, I'd like to thank you, the watcher, for making the best of this virtual ceremony. Thank you again, and please enjoy the ceremony. Hi, I'm Kiana Harker, and as the Bret Hart High School valedictorian, I want to celebrate with my classmates of the class of 2020. Hi, I'm Love Deep Carr, and as the Bret Hart High School salutatorian, I will also be highlighting this year's celebration. 
To begin, I would like to thank my family and friends for all of their support over the past four years. I would like to thank my parents, my siblings, and friends for supporting me throughout my education, especially during these difficult times. We would also like to thank our teachers and administrators for supporting our education and the staff members who have always kept our campus beautiful. We entered Bret Hart as scared little freshmen, tadpoles, with no idea that four years later we would be graduating in this way. We were told from the beginning that high school flies by and we always doubted it, but standing here today, that has never felt more true. None of us could have imagined ending our senior year like this. However, we will always be able to recount the memories and the good times. For example, we will never forget the crazy scholarship bowls that were put on, such as the World Culture Bowl, where everyone was able to watch students and teachers eat all kinds of strange foods, or the Spooky Bowl, where we got to draw clown faces on contestants who answered incorrectly. We will always remember the little things, such as going to sporting events, ribbits and croaks at rallies, school dances, and of course having lunch with our friends every day. An organization that many of us have participated in is the Future Farmers of America. FFA is a wonderful organization with so many accomplishments and opportunities, including the floral team winning state and placing six nationally last year and the annual Kiss a Pig rally, where students get excited to watch teachers such as Mrs. Maurer and Mr. Sadler compete for the privilege to kiss pigs, chickens, and lambs in front of the entire school. The members of the class of 2020 are blessed with many skills and talents, which can be seen through amazing performances in the varied drama productions like Legally Blonde and the comedy shows throughout the years. We have skilled musicians as well, which is evident from our band's performances in the football stands and in the orchestra pit. We would also like to acknowledge our talented academic team, which has gone to state three of the last four years. This class has faced numerous obstacles throughout our education. As freshmen, we were introduced to lockdown and active shooter drills. Our senior year began with being home with power outages and ended with being home in quarantine. COVID-19 has disrupted our high school experience and caused us tremendous difficulties. For example, it has amplified the problems of the past. Those of us who found it difficult to focus before were thrown for a loop. Going from seeing our friends every day to not seeing them at all was a difficult adjustment to make. Learning new content became even more challenging. Instead of learning in a classroom setting, we have had to resort to spending our time learning through a computer screen on Zoom and Google Classroom. Despite all of the adversity, all of us will be walking away with several accomplishments. From success within our sports to academic achievements, we should all be extremely proud of ourselves. Graduating in itself is a great feat because there were distractions and difficulties along the way. However, we still worked hard and made it. Congratulations to the class of 2020 on finding the strength to move through these tumultuous times. Not only does our experience connect the Bret Hart class of 2020, but it is a shared experience that unites us with everyone around the globe who is graduating this year as we all share the responsibility of building the future. This class will forever be remembered as the class that succeeded against the odds, and our experience has prepared us for what life might throw at us next. Ralph Waldo Emerson once said, what lies behind us and what lies before us are tiny matters compared to what lies within us. We have dealt with obstacles in the past and will without a doubt deal with obstacles in the future. However, we all have what it takes to succeed. Our generation must be willing to think outside of the box because we are the future. We must learn from our past and work conscientiously towards a better future. These unique circumstances give our generation, Generation Z, the power to shape the future. Z may come at the end of the alphabet, but it's not the end, but the beginning of the future full of possibilities. We ultimately don't know what the future holds as we are entering into the unknown, but what we do know is that our class consists of future healthcare workers, scientists, engineers, leaders, and much more. Working together with our many skills and talent as problem solvers, we can create a future that will be better and it will be ours. We are stepping into our role as adults. This means we will be responsible for choosing our own paths in life. Next year, some of us may be going to college, joining the workforce, or the military. Whatever you may decide to do in the future, make sure it is something that makes you happy. Because as Harry Styles once said, 
If you're happy doing what you're doing, then nobody can tell you you're not successful. We wish you all the best in life and thank you all for an amazing four years. We will forever cherish the memories and friendships we've made here at Bret Hart. And as Mr. Randall always says, remember there are things to do, worlds to save, swings to swing on, we wish, we wish you, you well. well.
Good evening, and welcome to the Bret Hart Union High School District's virtual graduation ceremony for the class of 2020. Parents, congratulations on a job well done. This spring, for the first time since World War II, there will be almost no in-person graduation ceremonies in the United States. High schools across the country have been forced to act swiftly to adjust how we educate during the COVID-19 pandemic. Classes were moved online and a new era of distance learning began. Graduation ceremonies became a public health hazard and schools scrambled to reinvent what had been a long-standing tradition. History will note that citizens of our country viewed their lives in two parts, before the coronavirus pandemic and life after. Class of 2020, our country is calling on you, our new graduates, to rise to the occasion of helping the world to rebuild. Each of you has been given the tools to think, solve, communicate, con contribute, and succeed. The class of 2020 will use this education to prepare for occupations that may not have existed before this pandemic. A large percentage of the class of 2020 will likely work in jobs that don't yet exist today. The experiences you have gained through these times of great sacrifice have prepared you to take on the challenge of restoring our country to a new measure of normalcy. I know that each of you is up to this challenge. The future remains uncertain, but as we celebrate what you've done over the last four years, it's certain that you will not let us down. What an exciting adventure. On behalf of the entire Bret Hart family, I would like to wish you the best of luck and thank you for allowing us to play a small part in your success. It is my pleasure to accept the class of 2020. Thank you and have a great night. Zoe Hartsnick. Daniel Abondo, Hayden Hubbard, James Evacelia, Faith Blodgett, Jonah Cardoza. Emma Canapa, Evan Dalton, Adam Angie, Jocelyn Gomez, Brendan Deshaun. Caitlin Carroll Maximilian Berg Spencer Cabral Jody Hall Kirk Grimm John Eric Donaire, Kayla Gonzalez, Katia Barboza, Nicole Dana, Taylor Fout. Jillian Buteau
Jarrett Hampton. Chloe Crawford. Tyler Crawford. Emma Garcia. Gabrielle Hutchins. Kiana Parker. Kinley Apley. Haley Carlson. Ethan Hickman. Sophia Garcia. Natalie Cox. Quincy Camper. Mallory Evans. Emmanuel Barboza. Nicholas Johnson. Arman Abusadi. Mackenzie Blair. Jonica Fernandez. Jackson Dodds. Samuel Arola. David Crow. Wyatt Carr. Odie Johnson. Jaden Bittner. Victor Gallardo. Lexi Campus. Desiree Acevedo. Taylor Graham. Milagros Ish. Carly Juarez. Johnny Henry. Pearl Rollings. Devin Carlson. Cassandra Yoder. Haley Railing. Sewell Hatcher. Jenna Leary. Joanna Ramos. Andrew Nuss. Derek Lowry. Logan Payton. Jeremiah Paulson. Dominic Santella. Sophia Lycia. Kara Schetzlein. Gage Perry. Emmanuel Nava. Justin Reyes. Sarah Smith. Eden Straw. 
Balji Singh. Cooper Moreland. Marissa Tosh. Cody Nordvik. Rose Madrano. Colby Dickman. Chloe Cockshot. Caitlin Warren. Desiree Murray. Bryce Mays Smith. Morgan Middleton. Madison Wolfman. Devin Pryor. Martin Kafka. Katrina Swift. Jimena Solis Sanchez. Mark Woodleaf. Kelsey Stevenson. Hunter Sturm. Lillian Hudberry. Rowan Perry. Braden Walker. Kaylani Mills. Jeffrey Morton. Jennifer Morton. Madeline Ruff. Drew O'Flynn. Bren Nobles. Morgan Rolleri. James Colby. Emily Trent. Brenna Landis. Olivia Lilly. Kitsia Rodriguez Berrigan. Grayson Mobley. Love Deep Carr. Annika Kruger. Riley Lowell. Kenneth Salvi. Indigo Stang. Isabella Lagamarsino. Kevin McGee. Anna Tilbrook. Cheris Holbert. Seth Homan. Matthew Bishop. Sierra Hughes. Alana Rodriguez. Elijah Hornbuckle. Nicholas Dalzell. 
Travis Paulden. Jeremy Strittenberger. Armando Morfin Covarubius. Olivia Griffiths. Angela Graham. Sheridan Putt. Savannah Clopton. Jonathan Rios. Billy Akins. Avalon Schneider. Good evening. On behalf of the governing board, I would like to congratulate all of you on the completion of this milestone in your life. It is with great pride that I address you today as you complete your graduation requirements and begin the next leg of your journey. This is my 13th graduation speech as superintendent, and I continue to be impressed with the accomplishments of each graduating class. As a class of 2020, you have brought a joy to our hearts and demonstrated a strength and resilience far beyond your years. Your parents remember your first, such as the first day of kindergarten and the first time that you read a book. They remember every new school year as you began a new grade. This year's first day of school may have been particularly difficult because it was your last first day of school prior to high school graduation. They also remember when you began participating in your first activities. It may have been dance, scouts, music, or sports, followed by your first recital, your first badge ceremony, your first art show, your first choir or instrumental performance, or your first sporting event. These same people have also been there for your, during your setbacks and disappointments, ones they wished you didn't have to experience, but they were there for you, providing guidance, advice, comfort, and sometimes just a shoulder to cry on. They were also there for you to help us celebrate your graduation and the memories that will last forever. So, class of 2020, regardless of what your plans are for the next month or next year, I encourage you to embrace the challenges that life will create for you. We look forward to hearing about and seeing where your journey will take you and how each of you will make this world a better place. And as Roy Rogers, the singing cowboy would sing, happy trails to you until we meet again. Once again, congratulations and good luck. And now, ladies and gentlemen, the graduating classes of Bret Hart, High, John Vieira High, Vallecito High have met all of the requirements as established by the Bret Hart Union High School District Governing Board of Education and the State of California. I am pleased and honored to present to you the Bret Hart High School District graduating classes of 2020. Hi, I'm Adam Angie, and I'd like to thank my parents for always for helping me throughout this high school. And I'd like to thank my coaches for always being there to help me with either school or a problem I had during school and for always making me the man who I am today. Hi, my name is Annika Kruger and I would like to thank my mom, dad, sister and grandma, as well as all of my friends for their love, support and encouragement throughout my four years. I would not be where I am today without you all and I love you so very much. Hi, my name is Armand Abusadi. And I want to thank a number of people for helping me get through the four high school years. First, I want to thank my personal friends like Kirk Van Grimm, Kayla Gonzalez, and Noah Carrillo. I also want to thank my family, my caring mother and my loving father, and my two siblings, Amir and Ali Khan. I finally want to thank the teachers who helped me, like Mr. Dugan, Mr. Anderson, and Jerry Maurer. Costa Rica crew, thank you. Hi, my name is Buljeet Singh. I would like to thank my parents, brother, sister-in-law, 
my coaches and the Brow Art staff, and most importantly, all my friends for making these great memories. Hi, my name is Kara Schutzlein, and I want to thank my amazing friends and family who have supported me throughout high school. Hi, I'm Cassandra Yoder, and I'd like to thank my friends and family. Hi, my name is Chloe Cockshot, and I would like to thank my entire family, especially my mom and all my friends throughout high school. Hi, my name is Clay Crawford. I would like to thank my whole family for their consistent love and support. Um, I would especially like to thank my mom and dad for always encouraging me to be the best person that I can be and for being there for every up and every down. And to Tyler, thank you for being you so that I did not have to take this 12 year journey alone. I feel so blessed and I love you all. Thank you. Hi, my name is Colby Dickman. and I'd like to thank my family and my great group of friends. Hi, my name is Cooper Moreland. I would like to thank my parents for always being there to support me and for pushing me to do as much as I can to be successful. I would like to thank Ms. Truman for pushing me to apply for things I normally wouldn't have and Mr. Randall for holding me to a high standard. I would also like to thank the rest of our exceptional faculty that I would likely be lost without. Finally, I would like to thank Nicholas, Jackson, Annalise, and the boys for keeping me sane when I had my nose to the grindstone. Hi, I'm Derek Lowry, and I'd like to thank my family and friends for continued support over the years. Hello, my name is Desiree Acevedo. I would like to show my appreciation towards my memory, my poetry, my boyfriend Grayson, all of my friends, and the rest of my family members. They have shown me endless support throughout this journey of mine and will support me in my future in college. Hi, my name is Desiree Murray. This year, I would like to thank friends of mine who are Grayson Mobley, Dominic Santella, Brayden Walker, and my little sister, Grace Murray. They've made senior year so memorable and so awesome, and there's so many fun memories with them, and I'm gonna miss them when I go off to college. I would also like to thank my parents who are my biggest support system and they've always believed in me and they're like the strongest people I know and I love them so much. Thank you mom, thank you dad, thank you Grace, thank you friends. I love and I will, go, I will miss all of you. Hi, my name is Devin Pryor and I would like to thank my family, my friends, and the amazing staff at Bret Hart for supporting me through my four years of high school. Hi, my name is Dominic Santella, and the people I'd like to thank are my mom and dad for being there all these years for me at Bret Hart and uh, being supportive and helpful. Um, the other people I'd like to thank is the rest of my family and all the friends who are there with me as well. So just a shout out to you guys. Thank you. I'm Drew O'Flynn, and I'd like to thank my friends, my family, and everyone who has supported me through my high school career, and uh, God be graduating. woo -hoo. Hi, my name is Eben Dalton, and I would like to thank my aunt and uncle for helping me through high school. And I'd also like to thank my friends for dealing with me throughout the high school experience. Hello, my name's Emmanuel Nava. I'd like to give a big shout out to my parents for always pushing me to do my best my sister for always driving me around places, and my brother for always cheering me on during games. I'd like to also thank my friends for making these past four years so memorable, and my coaches as well for trying to make me a better person on and off the field. And last but not least, a big thank you to all my teachers for always putting up with me. Hi everyone, and congratulations class of 2020. My name is Emma Garcia. I would like to thank my parents, my sisters, my grandparents, my boyfriend and his family, and all the friends that I have made or kept over the past four years. Everyone has helped me out so much, and I really appreciate them. I love you all, and thank you again. Hi, my name is Emmanuel Barboza, and I would like to thank my friends and family. Hi, my name is Faith Blodgett, and I would like to thank my hardworking parents all of my amazing, yet annoying siblings. Family means everything, so thanks guys. I would also like to thank my sergeants, Magrin, Goldberg, and Loman for steering me on my career path in the Army. It- Faith, what? you just hit me and Mom said you have to handle it. Is that my shirt? I'm sitting for it. Bye! Out. Thanks. Hi, my name is Gabrielle Hutchins, and I would like to thank my mom and all my siblings for all their help and support. 
Hello, my name is Gage Perry. I would like to thank my mother and my father for always being there for me through all the hard times of high school. There were many, but luckily I made it through every single one. And I'd also like to thank my friends. They were so close to me and helped me through anything I ever needed. Anything I needed, they'd give it to me. Uh, those people were Justin Reyes, Joseph Tolbert, Andrew Ness, and Hunter Stern. Thank you very much. This is Garrett Hampton, and I would like to thank my family and friends for making the past four years of high school really memorable. Hi, my name is Haley Rayling, and I would like to thank my mom, my dad, and my little sister for always being there and supporting me. And I would also like to thank my friends for giving me the best high school experience. Hi, my name is Haley Carlson. I'd like to thank my mom and my dad for everything that they have helped me through during Brat Heart. It has been a roller coaster ride, and I couldn't have appreciated anyone else by my side besides them. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Hi, my name is Hunter Sturm. I would like to thank all my friends and family for helping me throughout high school. Hi, my name is Jackson Dodds. And I would like to thank my friends and family that have supported me all throughout my high school career. I would also like to take this time to thank the teachers that I devoted so much time and energy in creating a brighter generation here at Bret Hart. Thank you. Hi, my name is James Colby. I'd like to thank my mom and dad for all their love and support through all four years of high school. I'd also like to thank my grandparents for their support as well. All of them have helped me through all of the difficult and not so easy times of high school. Thanks. I'd also like to thank Mr. Allard for teaching me in band for five years since eighth grade. Hi, my name is Jeffrey Morton. I would like to thank my friends and family for all the support they've given me over the past four years. I couldn't have done it without you guys. Hi, my name is Jenna Leary. I would like to thank my mom, dad, siblings, and the rest of my family, along with all the amazing teachers I've had in the last 12 years, for making my educational experience so amazing the last 12 years. Thank you, all of you guys, for being there for me every step of the way. Hi, my name is Jenny Morton, and I would like to thank my friends, family, and teachers for pushing me to do my best throughout this high school experience. Hi, my name is Jeremiah Paulson, and I would like to thank uh, my girlfriend, Caitlin Carroll, my parents, my sisters, and everyone else who helped me get to this point. I'd also like to thank the teachers and Bret Hart administration for uh, putting up with my shenanigans for four years and never giving up. Uh, thank you all for pushing me to succeed. Hello, my name is Jillian Beto. I would like to thank my parents and my best friends for continuing supporting me through the past four years. I couldn't have done it without you. I would also like to thank my teachers for inspiring me and pushing me to do my best. Hi, my name is Jimena Solis and I would like to thank all my family, including my parents, Gabby and Thomas, my brother Brian, and all my friends who have supported me throughout the four past years. Thank you. Hola, me llamo Joanna. Les quería decir gracias a mis padres. Gracias por todo el apoyo que me han dado todos estos años. Gracias por mostrarme que siempre debería trabajar duro y nunca rendirme. Gracias a ustedes, sé que puedo lograr cualquier cosa. Soy tan agradecida de poder tenerlos como padres. Los quiero mucho. Mabel. Hi, my name is Jocelyn Gomez. I would like to thank my mom, my dad, and my two sisters for always encouraging me to be my best and for supporting my crazy ideas. Hi, my name is Jody Hall, and I'd first like to thank all of my friends for being there for me, for distracting me when I need it, and for making my life a better place. I'd also like to thank my family for your constant support and for trusting me no matter what throughout all these years. Thank you, guys. Hey, my name is John Eric Dunaire. I would like to thank my parents, teachers, and friends for the support they've given me over the past years. So, thank you. Hi, my name is Jonica Fernandez, and I would like to thank my dad, Tracy, my brothers, my dogs, and everyone else who helped me get to this point. Thank you. Hi, I'm Caitlin Carroll, and I'd like to thank my mom and dad for doing the best they can at raising us. And um, I'd like to thank the Paulson family for doing all they can for my sister and I and being like a second family for us. And my boyfriend, Jeremiah, for being there for me whenever I need him. And lastly, I'd like to thank the Bret Hart administration for handing me my diploma today. <laughs> 
Hello, my name is Caitlin Warren, and I'd like to thank my mom and dad for all their love and support throughout my high school years. Hi, my name is Carly Woods. I would like to thank all my friends and family for all the love and support over these last four years. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you. Hi, my name is Katrina Swift. I'd particularly like to thank my mom, dad, and sister for always being so supportive. I'd also like to thank all my friends and extended family. Hi, my name is Kayla Gonsalves. I would like to thank all of my friends and family and all of my teachers for helping me through these past four years. But especially, I would like to thank Mr. Dugan and Mr. Anderson, whether they were playing a part as a teacher or helping me in all of the performances that took place in the Bret Hart Theater. Howdy, my name is Kenny Selvey. I'd like to thank my parents, my friends, my dogs, my trucks, my teachers, and everybody else that's helped me through four years of high school. Thank you. Bye. Hi, my name is Kevin McGee, and I would like to thank my friends uh, Brian Ordiel, Will Klotz, and my and others for for making my year, uh, making my high school years entertaining. And I would also like to thank my uh, my parents and especially Miss Teal for helping me out through my high school years. Hi, my name is Kiana Harker. I would like to thank my mom, my grandma, my sister, the rest of my family, and my friends for all of your support. Hi, my name is Kinley Apley, and today I would like to thank my friends and my family for the love and support that they have shown me over the years. I would also like to thank my church family for the encouragement to stay strong in my faith. This one's for you, Mom. I did it. Hi, my name is Kurt Graham, and I'd like to thank those who have pushed me on through all my high school years, kept me on task and working. My mom, my dad, my brother, Jess, thank you all for your love and support. Hi. I'm Lexi Campus. I'd like to give a huge thanks to my mom, her twin, and my sister for giving me the push I needed and all the love and support to get me through these four years. It's been absolutely crazy and I couldn't have done it without you guys. Thank you so much. I love you guys. Hi, my name is Lily Tedbury. I would like to start off by thanking my mom and dad. They've given me so much love and support throughout my 12 years of school and especially through my four years of high school. If it weren't for them, I would not be where I am today. I would also like to thank all of my friends. Thank you for always being there and making so many amazing memories throughout high school. I love you all. Hello, my name is Madeline Ruff, and I would like to thank my parents, family, friends, and advisors for all of their love and support these past four years. Love you guys. Hi, my name is Madison Wolfman, and I would like to thank my friends, family, community, and teachers. You've all left an impact on me, whether it be big or small, and have made me into the woman I am today. Hi, my name is Mallory Evans. I'd like to thank my parents, my siblings, and all my friends for helping me get through this tough time while still making the end of my senior year enjoyable. Thank you guys, and I love you. Hi, my name is Martin Kafka, and I would like to thank my mom, my dad, and both of my grandparents. Hi, my name is Mackenzie Blair, and I would first like to thank my parents for supporting me all throughout high school and pushing me to do my best for the past 12 years. I would also like to thank my Oma and Opa for supporting me and coming to all my cross country and track meets. And finally, I would like to thank Mr. Burns for making me the athlete I am today and opening so many doors to greater opportunities. Hi, my name is Marissa Tosh and I would like to thank my mom, my dad, family and friends for supporting me in the last 12 years and making me the person I am today. I can't wait for what my future holds for me. Hi, my name is Milagros Gish and I would like to thank my mom, my dad and my two little brothers for supporting me and pushing me to do my best. I would also like to thank my coaches for showing me what hustle and heart is and my friends for giving me this incredible high school experience. Hi, my name is Morgan Middleton, and I would like to thank my parents and my huge family and my best friend Chloe for all of our fun memories throughout high school. Hi, my name is Morgan Rillary. I would like to thank my amazing family, friends, and community for all their love and support throughout the years. Hi, my name is Natalie Cox, and I would like to thank my parents, Sam and Grammy, my siblings and friends, and Waylon for their support in every aspect of my life. Hi, my name is Nicole Dina. I'd like to thank my 
Mom, dad, friends, and family for always supporting me and encouraging me throughout my four years of high school. Thank you. Hi, my name is Quincy Camper, and I would like to thank my parents for always pushing me to do my absolute best and for the rest of my family for always believing in me. Love you guys. Hi, my name is Rowan Perry. I would like to thank my family, friends, and teachers who've helped me along the way. Hi, my name is Samuel Rolla. I would like to thank both my friends and my family and all those who supported me throughout my four years of high school. Thank you. Hi, my name is Sarah Smith, and I would like to thank my family for their unconditional support and my friends for making high school so much better. Hey, I'm Sophia. First off, I would like to give thanks to my mom, dad, and grandparents for always encouraging me to do well in school. Thank you to the teachers who worked hard keeping me focused and on track. Thank you, April Gaylord, for all the extra help. You rock. I struggled most of my years in school, and I feel so unreal to be standing here receiving my high school diploma. I didn't think I'd be graduating under a pandemic and a toilet paper shortage. This is one for the history book. Hi, my name is Sophia Lisea, and I would like to say a huge thank you to my mom, my friends, and my teachers for always encouraging and supporting me through my four years of high school. Hi, my name is Spencer Gabriel. I would like to thank my mom, my brother, my cat Punky, my grandpa, and Alfred for always being there for me, loving me unconditionally, never giving up on me, and believing in me. I love you. Miss Davis, Mr. Breda, Miss Oliver, and Mr. Dugan. Thank you for these past four years teaching me how to be myself, listening to me, and just being amazing people. Hi, my name is Tiona Bennett. I would like to thank my family and friends, and I would also like to thank my parents for always supporting me. My name is Tyler Crawford. I would like to thank all of my family, my aunts and uncles, my grandparents, and my friends who have all been leaders in how to live my life. I would especially like to thank my incredible parents. You both are my inspiration, my mentors, and my guide. I would be lost without you. I love and appreciate you all very much. Thank you. Hi, my name is Victor Gallardo. I would like to thank my amazing mom and brother, Lene and Dylan Parsons. I would like to thank my amazing friends, teachers, and coaches for guiding me throughout high school and making it very enjoyable. Hello, my name is Zoe Hartzink. I would like to thank my family, my best friends, and Mrs. Phillips for the constant love and support that it took to nurture me through this journey. And now, we're here. We made it. Hi, my name is Brendan Sean. I would like to thank my family who has supported me throughout all the stepping stones of life. Uh, they have always been there through all the ups and downs, which it has fortunately been mostly ups. I would also like to thank um, my friends and my teachers who have guided me throughout high school, throughout Michelson, Avery, and Bret Hart. I love all you guys. Thank you. Hi, my name is Pearl Rawlings, and I'd like to thank my family and friends and everyone who's helped me through high school. Thank you. My name is Olivia Griffiths, and I'd like to thank my mom and dad and sister for helping me graduate from Velocito. Hi, my name is Sheridan Putt. I would like to thank all my friends and my family for giving me the love and support throughout the year. I wanted to say thank you and I love you all so much for giving me everything I need to get through this year and succeed. Thank you all and I love you. Buenas tardes. Mi nombre es Jimena Solís y esta tarde representaré a nuestra valedictoriana de Bert Hart High School, Kiona Harker. A ella le gustaría celebrar con sus compañeros de la clase del 2020. Hola, me llamo Joana Ramos y yo seré la traductora de Love Deep Car, nuestra saludatoria de Brehart High School. Y ella quisiera destacar la celebración de este año. Para empezar esta celebración, me gustaría darle gracias a mi familia, amigos y profesores por todo su apoyo durante estos cuatro años. Quisiera agradecer a mis padres, mis hermanos y amigos por siempre apoyarme durante mi educación y tiempos difíciles. Nos gustaría también agradecer a nuestras maestras y maestros y a los administradores por siempre apoyar nuestra educación. También a los miembros que ayudan a mantener nuestro campus hermoso. Entramos a Bret Hart High School como estudiantes de primer año con miedo, o como unos dicen, renacuajos, ni con la menor idea que así va a ser nuestra graduación este año. 
Desde el principio de la escuela secundaria siempre nos decían que el tiempo volaba, pero nosotros los dudábamos. Pero ahora que aquí estamos parados, nunca se ha sentido más real. Ninguno de nosotros nos imaginamos que así se cabería nuestro último año de la escuela secundaria. Pero nunca se nos olvidará que podremos contar los buenos tiempos y memorias que tuvimos. Por ejemplo, nunca se nos va a olvidar las competiciones locas para becas que nosotros dirigimos, como la competición llamada Mundial, donde los estudiantes podían ver a los maestros y otros estudiantes comerse comidas únicas y raras, o como la competición llamada Espantos, donde nosotros pudimos dibujar caras de payaso a los competidores que contestaban la pregunta incorrectamente. Siempre recordaremos las cosas pequeñas, como los eventos deportivos, los rivets y crocs en las reuniones de la escuela, los bailes y, por supuesto, teniendo almuerzo, almuerzos con nuestros amigos todos los días. Una organización que muchos de nosotros pudimos ser parte de se llama Los Futuros Granjeros de América. FFA es una organización espléndida con muchas oportunidades, incluyendo el equipo de Floral, que igual son las campeones del estado con sexto lugar el último año. Igual la reunión llamada Besa un Puerco, donde los estudiantes se emocionan al ver maestros como Mrs. Maurer y Mr. Sadler competir para ganarse el privilegio de besar puercos, pollos, gallinas y borregos delante de toda la escuela. Los miembros de la clase del 2020 son bendecidos con muchas habilidades y talentos en las que pueden ser vistas en las increíbles actuaciones en las variadas producciones dramáticas como Legally Blonde, Legalmente Rubia, y las obras de comedia durante los años. Tenemos muchos músicos talentosos, lo cual es evidente por las actuaciones de nuestra banda en los Juegos del Fútbol Americano en la orquesta. También queremos dar reconocimiento a nuestro talentoso equipo de decathlon académico que fueron a los finales del estado tres de los cuatro años. Nuestra clase ha superado muchos obstáculos durante nuestra educación. En nuestro primer año fuimos introducidos a los cierres de emergencia y prácticas de emergencia en caso que un tiroteo activo ocurriera en los terrenos de la escuela. Nuestro último año empezó con cortes de energía y terminó con la cuarentena. COVID-19 ha interrumpido nuestra experiencia de la escuela secundaria y nos ha causado enormes dificultades. Por ejemplo, ha amplificado los problemas del pasado. Aquellos de nosotros a los que antes nos resultaba difícil concentrarse se nos hizo mucho más difícil y fue muy difícil no poder ver nuestros amigos todos los días. Aprendiendo nuevo material de la escuela era muy difícil. En vez de aprender en aula, teníamos que pasar tiempo estudiando por computadora todo el día en Zoom y Google Classroom. A pesar de todas las adversidades, todos nos iremos con muchos logros. Desde el éxito dentro de nuestros deportes hasta los logros académicos, todos deberíamos estar orgullosos de nosotros mismos. Graduarse en sí mismo fue un gran logro porque hubo distracciones y dificultades en el camino, pero aún trabajamos duro y lo logramos. Felicidades a la clase del año 2020 por encontrar las fuerzas y sobrepasar estos tiempos difíciles. No solo nos han unido más entre nosotros mismos como la clase de Bret Hart del año 2020, pero igual estamos compartiendo esta experiencia con todos los graduados de la nación, en cual es nuestra responsabilidad crear un futuro. Esta clase será recordada para siempre como la clase que tuvo éxito durante tiempos drásticos. Y esta experiencia nos ha preparado para cualquier obstáculo que la vida nos presente. Ralph Waldo Emerson una vez dijo, lo que se encuentra detrás de nosotros y lo que se encuentra enfrente de nosotros son asuntos pequeños en comparación a lo que se encuentra entre nosotros. Hemos tratado con obstáculos en el pasado y sin duda lo haremos en el futuro. Sin embargo, todos nosotros tenemos lo que se necesita para tener éxito. Nuestra generación debe estar dispuesta a pensar en grande porque somos el futuro. Tenemos que aprender del pasado y trabajar hacia un futuro mejor. Estas circunstancias únicas nos dan nuestra generación, generación Z, el poder de formar un mejor futuro. Z tal vez sea la última letra del abecedario, pero no es el fin, solo el principio de un futuro lleno de posibilidades. Al fin del día, uno nunca sabe lo que nos espera en el futuro donde entramos en un mundo inesperado. Pero algo que sí se sabe es que nuestra clase está llena de futuros médicos, científicas, ingenieros, líderes y mucho más. Trabajando juntos con nuestros múltiples talentos y la habilidad de resolver problemas, podemos crear un futuro mejor y será nuestro. Estamos entrando en nuestro papel de adultos. Eso significa que seremos responsables de elegir nuestros propios caminos en la vida. En el próximo año, algunos acudiremos a una universidad, estaremos 
trabajando y algunos servirán al ejército. Lo que sea que elijas hacer en la vida, asegúrense que sea algo que los haga feliz. Porque como Harry Styles dijo una vez, si eres feliz haciendo lo que estás haciendo, nadie te puede decir que no tienes éxito. Les deseamos la mejor vida y gracias a todos por cuatro años increíbles. Siempre recordaremos las memorias y amistades bonitas que hemos hecho en Bret Hart. Y como siempre dice el profesor Randall, recuerden que hay cosas que hacer, mundos para salvar, columpios para columpiarse, Le te deseamos, deseamos lo mejor. mejor.